Catherine Groenestein last updated 1637, September 27, 2017 Rare quadruplet heifer calves born in White Otara. Blossom, Bonnie, Bluebell and Belinda don't know it, but they're extremely rare. So rare, in fact, that when the quadruplet calves arrived, South Taranaki farmer Michael Kavanagh had them DNA tested to prove they really were all from one mother something that happens less than once in every 650,000 cattle births. The DNA test results arrived back on Wednesday, bringing smiles all round for Michael and his parents, Danny and Eileen, who farm together at White Otara. Tucker time for the quad babies. Before heifers were born to a cow named Becky on August 23rd, a blustery, wet evening. Read more rare triplet heifer calves thriving on Taranaki farm triplet calves surprised Tatuanui farm manager Boaz Rahin after finishing the afternoon milking. Michael Kavanagh went to check on the Springer's cows due to calf, and discovered a little calf, then saw that a cow named Becky was in labor. Danny and Eileen Kavanagh and their son Michael have quadruplet calves born on the White Otara farm on August 23rd. He helped her deliver another small calf, but the cow didn't stop there. We were excited about twins, so we all rushed out to the paddock. Then there was another one born, Eileen Kavanagh said. They decided to move Becky and her three babies into the nearby shed for shelter. Eileen Kavanagh is a favorite with two of the quadruplet calves. She was really slow. We had to walk her all the way. Then I realized she was still in labor, Michael said. When he checked the cow's uterus for tears, he felt another calf, so he helped her deliver that too. The calves were small but healthy. Each weighed around 30 kilograms, meaning the cow had been carrying about 120 kilograms of calves. Michael Kavanagh with three of the calves. She was huge s-h-e-s a big cow but she was extra huge. All the calves have names beginning with B because their mother is Becky and their father an L-I-C bull named Byburn. The four all have pink ear tags and are living in a pen with straw bedding and getting extra good care, he said. Michael Kavanagh with Becky, mother of the quadruplet calves. Mum's making sure of that. Six-year-old Becky was recovering well after developing ketosis and needing TLC following the calves' birth. Quadruplets are a rare occurrence in dairy cattle, LIC research scientist Lorna McNaughton said. The incidence of quadruplets is reported as 1,650,000 in beef cattle, have all four calves be heifers and in good health is particularly lucky. They would be a good boost to the farm's heifer-calf ratio. The DNA results had confirmed the heifers as non-identical quadruplets, so the cow would have produced four separate eggs all fertilized by one LIC insemination, she said. Harwira vet Kathy Thompson said she had only heard of one other set of quadruplet calves born in Harwira about 10 years ago, but in that case only two calves had survived and the mother died as well. To have all four survive and the mother as well is a much better news story, she said. Stuff.